Hello everyone, welcome back. Today I'm excited to introduce Lost Fuzzer, a powerful script I made for discovering nuclei DAST vulnerabilities by using passive URLs. Whether you're into bug bounty hunting or security research, Lost Fuzzer can help automate security testing, identify misconfigurations, and streamline your reconnaissance process. As always, ethical hacking requires proper authorization, so ensure you have explicit permission before testing any assets. This video is purely for educational purposes. Let's dive in. All right, first, I'm going to show you a dorking script I made for fast results with a large number of URLs. You can use any of these dorks to find spill injection vulnerabilities. For this proof of concept, I'll use this simple school dork. Just enter the dork, select how many URLs you want, or choose all to grab as many as possible before Google rate limits it. Then give your output file a name and hit enter. As you can see, within a second, we've got all the URLs. Now, let's check the output file. The results only contain URLs, no extra numbering, just clean scroll dork results. Now, let's see how many URLs we found. Nice, we got 290 URLs. Right. Next, I'll use a grep rejects to filter out only the parameterized URLs. This ensures we only test URLs that accept input parameters, because those are more likely to be vulnerable. Now, let's run this custom error-based school injection template, which have the highest success rate. And within seconds, boom, we've got multiple school vulnerable URL. To exploit these, you can use Gori's batch scan mode. Just put all the vulnerable URLs in a list file and run this command. That's it. Gauri will handle the rest. Now, due to YouTube's policy, I won't show the exploitation process here, but you can follow this method to do it yourself. Now, let me show you Lost Fuzzer, a script I made for fast subdomain and parameterized URL scanning. Here's how it works. Instead of testing subdomains one by one, it uses Xarg's parallel processing to scan 10 subdomains at the same time, making it way faster. A custom regex filter extracts only valid parameterized URLs, so we only test useful URLs. It uses URO to remove duplicates and sort command to keep only unique URLs. Since we're testing a lot of URLs, not just subdomains, I set HTTPX to use high threads, which makes scanning much faster. And finally, Nuclei runs with two retries, so if a URL fails to respond, it tries again for better accuracy. Now, let's run the script and test it with a single URL as a proof of concept. I'll use vonweb.com website. First, the script fetches all passive URLs using GeoView. Then, it filters out only parameterized URLs. After that, it checks which URLs are active. And finally, it runs Nuclei DAS scanning to detect fuzzing-based vulnerabilities using the default Nuclei DAS templates. And there you go. We found multiple vulnerabilities within seconds. After the scan finishes, the script creates two files a filtered URL list, which contains sorted, live URLs that you can test manually by using Burp Suite or other tools, and a vulnerability results file with all findings. Now, let's test this on a list of subdomains. I've added a few domains for this demo. And as you can see, we found so many vulnerabilities within seconds. If we did this manually, it would take a lot of time. But by using Nuclear DAS scanning, we can detect all vulnerabilities that DAS templates supports instantly. For more details, check the README file where I explain why I don't use Param Spider or active crawlers in this approach, and why I use my own rejects for parameterized URLs testing. That's a wrap for today's video. If you're new to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so you're always updated with our latest content. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.